Hello, Joe Cat. Thank you. Hello, Frost. Shout, do you, do, is it okay that Damn. I call you Frost? Is that too is informal? Like so I am bad at the game. I can I can play like normal, um, but I want to learn how to beat the heart on Ascension. I I say let's go again and let's let's uh yeah you try and do the, a more reasonable deck. You want to run the Ironclad again? Yeah, I just feel safer with the Ironclad. Like my favorite is definitely the Silent, but okay. it's just it takes more finagling to get a decent deck going in my in my experience anyway. Maybe Geocat it's easier. Plus. Actually, you know what? I want to I want to learn. Let's do, do it. it. Absolutely. So, I do like killing things early. Yeah, so uh, that is a common one that, like, you know, I go for as, as a content creator. It's like, oh my god, the possibility of a 1 HP elite snipe. I actually recently mm -hmm. got a 1 HP boss snipe. That was pretty hype. Um, oh. <laughs> but the issue with it is if you go for, like, so so elites can only appear at minimum on floor 6. And right. uh, if, they, if you're going that far and that's only your third combat, you're missing out on a lot of potential rewards, right? Your your deck right. isn't really ascending all that much, and so then you might get hurt immediately after that. The same that you would. So you but, don't have any cards. Yeah, so I would say if you're if you're really wanting to like learn, I would say one HP is actually the strongest start in the entire game. If you don't try to always go for the the RNG elite <laughs> coward, if you actually right. still take the safest path possible and like the smartest mm -hmm. path, not the safest, but the smartest path possible, right? You're still mm -hmm. going for the, the the same that you would play, but just with an easier start. Fantastic. I also think that removing two cards, I mean, we were talking about the transform last time. Removing mm -hmm. two cards is so insanely OP. That, I think, yeah. probably is my favorite. I love getting rid of starting cards. I'll go the path less traveled yeah. uh, as strike and a defend, yeah? Yeah. Yeah. You don't need defense as much since you have the survivor, so... Yeah, getting right. rid of your block density is not bad, but keeping strikes is really, really strong because that since the silent has more blocking capability early, she tends to falter if you take an elite too early without taking yeah good cards. So then you tend to get. F yeah, I'm so once I again eyeing the triple elite down yeah. here. Yeah. Uh, because I, I wouldn't if there wasn't another campfire there. Right. But yeah, so I think that that's a really good path also because of the pivot point early. That third floor you can get there, and or that fourth floor. Sorry. You could get there, and if your deck sucks, you just go the safer path to the right. And then you still get two elites or, you know, one elite at the end of the act, depending. There's multiple points where you can decide how safe or dangerous you're feeling. I could potentially pivot and get the burning elite early. Oh, hell yeah. Absolutely. Hmm. Okay. So, yeah, I mean, you could also go the, 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 the uh, like, a lot of people will frown on going the path with the shop. Um, because you're going to waste three relics, right? But you can definitely get a card removed there. Because the, the path on the right... Uh, do you know how normal fights and hard fights work? I don't think so, actually. So in Act 1, you'll get three normal fights, which is like your single jawworm, double slime, cultist. And then after that, uh, every combat will be the hard pool. The slavers, the the gremlin gang, the ones that always annoy the shit out of you. Uh, mm -hmm. And then in Act 2 and 3, it's two fights and then the hard pool. So going that mm -hmm. straight up path, that fourth hallway fight is guaranteed to be a hard pool. But if you take the shot path, it's guaranteed to not be a hard pull. Do I want the hard pull? Depends how your deck's doing. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, so mm. it's like, you did already remove two cards, so the likelihood that your deck is going to be strong enough to take it on is good. I would say if you're going to go that that hard pull fight, look for an AoE card. Look for a dagger spray, look for an all-out attack, something that's going to help you out with dealing with a bunch of dudes. Yes, yeah, Mudpip. It's wasted relics because what relics that show in the shop are gone. They're out of the pool. Mm -hmm. Yeah, you can't see them anymore. I'm going to go this straight path. Ah, oh, sweet. Um, um, that's probably not the way to go. It doesn't matter. Yeah, Jawworm is notably the most hated Act One fight by every Slay the Spire player, <laughs> like the, of the normal pool, just because they're like an elite that doesn't give you a card reward, and it's all random. <laughs> like sometimes you'll just get out of there without taking any damage, and sometimes you have to take like a mandatory twelve. Yes. Jawworm is is gross. So I usually popped into taking chip damage if possible like you know the yeah damage i was early. i was considering taking that one at the first turn hey you got away with it so mm -hmm. you made the right <clears> choice <throat> you're better than me cross is a good gamer i agree chat <laughs> i like poison stab here yeah so because... uh oh go ahead go ahead i i just like it uh mostly because of the the shell elite what's his face maybe deadly poison would be better but poison stab helps against gremlin knob yeah, um, so that that's the exact reason is 
that Poison Stab is better is because Gremlin Knob mm -hmm. exists. Because yeah. Gremlin Knob exists, you always want to take attacks early in order mm -hmm. to get it. So in the in the community, it's called Strike Pluses. So anything that looks like it's mm -hmm. a strike, but it does a little bit more. But it's better. Yeah. Mm -hmm. So like, yeah, yeah your, your dagger throws, your quick slashes, taking a couple of those early on will help you out very, very much. Even the little vampire bite thing, yeah? Yeah. Yeah. And I kill you. No, I cannot. <clears throat> should have striked. I can do this. I did should have striked. You're right. <laughs> Would have done more. Let's not dwell on the past. Sounds good. Didn't get punished. Good you go. Mm -hmm. Oh boy, catalyst! <laughs> that oh can, my god! I can function with, we with have my one poison poison stab. card. <laughs> we better take the catalyst. Here's the boss. Bosses, uh, hexaghost. Catalyst is delicious against hexaghost, but goddamn, mm. if that's a terrible time to take it. <laughs> Probably a sucker punch, yeah. Yeah, but what if we took the catalyst, Joe Cat? Huh? Yeah. What if we I mean, got we five start... gifted subscriptions and we'll take the the catalyst? We can start building our poison deck now. I haven't done a po yeah. good poison this deck is, in a while. Yeah, this is like one of the biggest uh, issues with with younger players to the game is they try to force builds, and that is yes, and you can't because extremely good way to lose. The yeah. game gives you whatever it gives you. You mm -hmm. can't build anything. Yeah, so I agree with you. The smarter play is to not take it. Whether that's mm -hmm. taking sucker punch or acrobatics, that's up to you. Uh, I prefer a sucker punch. I want to be safe. Sure. Yeah, I am notably the person who will not take an early catalyst, but I will always take an early accuracy. Mm-hmm. <laughs> the same. Yeah. Way better. There's just more ways of getting shivs in the game, right? Can um, this kill you? Well, kind of. I, I think there's. Uh, I think yeah. I think that like shivs scale faster off of one accuracy. Oh, you want to have a lot of fun? You want to make our brains hurt and want to kill ourselves? In a video game, of course. Because that's what Grand Finale does. Ah, uh, right. Yeah, no, I never pick that. Yeah, but this is how you get content. Oh, if we had taken the acrobatics, I would have I would have yelled at you to not take to, to take it. Uh, uh -huh. Like, okay, so if you think about it here, right? Can you get off Grand Finale in the next fight? No. You will never get it off. You're drawing seven cards on turn one. You, if you have 13 cards in your deck, you will never be able to be, have that perfect number without any draw on your deck. So right now, Grand Finale will literally be a curse unless you can remove a card. Yes, because we'll have 13 cards. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. I probably shouldn't take Cloak and Dagger, but every time I see Cloak and Dagger, I'm like, I could build a shift deck. Yeah, no, I think Cloak and Dagger is probably one of the worst shift cards in the game. I would mm -hmm. I would not take it. When it's upgraded, it's like, I, don't, I can never have enough, though. Yeah, but it's kind of bad, though. <laughs> oh, yeah? Well, maybe I like bad cards. I like Grand Finale, all right? <laughs> who's, look who's talking. So backflip, then? Yeah, backflip's good here. Um, Have fun with a hard pull fight with no AoE. This is going to be fun. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Oh, you got I'm it. I'm fine. So, uh, actually, speaking of those other fights in the game, uh, Blue Slaver used to be a normal fight. It used to be one of those first three, oh. four fights, but they took it out because it was the only one that didn't have an off turn. Because Slaver, this Blue Slaver always attacks you every single turn. Wow. Mm. So they, they figured that it was too unfair, but left... <laughs> Left jawworm. Interesting. How do you know all this stuff? Did they did like do like a dev interview or something? Um, so I used to make League of Legends content. Right. But, um, back in the day, that was like where I, I got my start on YouTube, and my content mm -hmm. was a series called How OP League Used to Be. It was just talking about like the history of the game. Um, mm. so yeah, I've always just been interested in like how the game used to be. I guess. Mm. Yeah, I like Blade Dance because even though it's a shiv card, it's just nice damage. It's one um, but I also damage. like Footwork. I think here, here's here's a hot take. Here's a hot take. Go ahead. Footwork is a noob trap. Oh, <gasps> how dare you! <laughs> how dare you say something that's probably completely true? Yeah, Footwork is a noob trap. There's you're 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 not getting a whole lot out of it, and you you like it takes so long to get online, and you're mm -hmm. usually the turn that you're getting a Footwork off, you're losing block overall. But Frost, instead of 15 block, I could play Footwork and get 14 block. Yeah, so that's like the, <laughs> the big thing is like, unless you have more stuff to combo with it, I wouldn't probably take a Footwork, especially not this early. Okay. You don't need that. Yeah, I'd take a Blade Dance. Okay. Um, I'm I would feeling notably, brave. 
I would I would elite. say no to the three elites. No. Because, so uh, let's 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 do a little bit of math here. All right. Let's do a little bit of math. You took four fights, right? First huh. fight it was a forty percent, fifty percent, sixty percent. This fight you just took is a seventy percent chance of a potion. You got one. So now it's down to a sixty percent mm -hmm. again, and you're gonna take one more fight. And you so you have a decent chance of getting another potion, and then you have to take on an elite with no scaling. If you get Lagavulin, you're probably dead. That's a one in three chance. And Tri Centuries is probably gonna take you down a lot of HP. And that's not um, even considering the fact that there's two, three hard pool fights surrounding him before the next elite. All right. Yeah, I would say all right, I'll, no. I'll take your word for it. Uh, what is this relic again? It's any relic. It's random. Oh, any. Mm -hmm. Oh shit. Okay. Um, I almost always go for the max HP. Yeah, I, I think if you're not going to heal fully off of the banana, always take donut. Mm -hmm. All right. Hmm. New tr the sucker punch. Sucker Blade punch is a, is a decent choice. Blade dance is the most damage. Um, mm -hmm. I don't really know. I'd probably oh, go, go sucker, sucker punch or blade dance, whichever one. Yeah. You're getting lucky Low. with these hard pull fights. Am I? Yeah. Isn't the isn't the silence starting relic just the best? It is nice. I made the mistake. I was in the noob trap ones where I was like, oh, I don't need more cards at the start of my turn. I can't even play them all. And I would almost like always swap it out for a boss. Where I'm like, oh, I can kill you. Sweet. Uh, but then you you don't really feel it. That's the deceptive thing about this game is you don't feel the mistakes you're making all the time. It's not immediately apparent, but I'm sure those. But cheap cards. Yeah. Yeah. You know how rare percentage works in this game? Is it similar to potions where like keep going up until uh, you get yeah. one and then it goes down? So you. It starts out at a negative 2% chance at floor at the first floor of every act. And every time that you see a common card in a card reward, it goes up. Until you see a rare card. And so we saw the grand finale, so it reset back to negative 2. But then all you're seeing is common cards. So, like, gotcha. yeah, you're fluctuating a lot. You Maybe deadly poison? Uh, deadly poison's a... I don't like that card ever. No. <laughs> it's such mm. a bad card. You know, we could have taken it if we took the catalyst early, but Oh my yeah. god, that's so true. <laughs> it's so true. Go back, well, prepared. Prepared is is an okay card early on because there's really just... no downside to it, right? It's drawn yeah, neutral, but, but it does You would have drawn that card anyway. Yeah, so it's drawn neutral and it well, it, technically it's actually drawn negative if you're talking about cards in your hand. Um Yes, cuz you're getting but... rid of one. Yeah, it's draw neutral in the sense that there's no pain to playing it now except against Gremlin Knob. Um, but it does allow you to spec into things later if you were to see like a reflex or right. things like that. It allows you to go into that into a, a more fun route later. So I think that adding one prepared early is fine. It probably won't hurt you. We say probably. There's, but... a, there's also that relic that uh, you get more energy. So I don't like this. By the way, Chad, every time I salute, that's me thanking a sub. If you guys could salute along with me, I'd love you to death. I'm going to be totally honest. I'm like second guessing all of my my plays because you're so good at the game. I'm like, uh, I don't want to I don't want to make Frost cringe. Yeah, close my eyes. I don't know what you're doing now. <laughs> yeah, okay. Nobody, wow, that was so good, man. Oh, thanks, oh dude. Uh, <laughs> just so much experience with this game, you know? <laughs> okay, yeesh. Uh, also, okay. uh, draw... Draw first is important, right? Before you do anything, like yeah, it's just like basically you're gonna draw stuff. anyway. Okay. Um, this guy. Hey, you're doing all right. You're full block. You're full blocking. I am. I should full block. I'm like, but I could get more damage off. Yeah, I mean, so the, the 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 blue the blue antlered guys are always scary because those are the guys that buff themselves, so they Frost they get out of seven. hand quickly, but. Yeah, I would Kill probably, you. uh, I, so I'm pretty sure on low ascension that they can't do the two attacks three times in a row. I don't quote me on that, but I'm pretty mm -hmm. sure that left guy is going to buff next turn. So okay. I would say probably at some capacity, I would attack the guy on the right in case you draw a kill on him next turn so that you don't have to mm -hmm. deal with him. Okay. And yeah. just block this? Yeah. All right. Because I'm, I'm pretty sure if I'm, if I'm wrong... Oh, please. I'm so smart. Oh, all right. Wait, you can buff turn two turns in a row? Oh, God. Low Ascension's crazy. Ooh. Yeah, I would go after the right guy. Right like, guy. Okay. Yeah, yeah, because you don't want them to keep buffing. They're going to be dealing a lot of damage next turn. Yeah. All right. 
Yeah, so he's going to die, and all you have to deal is six damage, which is super Yay. easy. Even though you're weakened, you'll probably draw two strikes, maybe smiley face. Look at that. Everybody's dead. Hooray. We did it. Ooh. Jeffs! Sorry. What was that? <laughs> uh, I'm just, I'm just admiring it. I'm just yeah. admiring. No, it's know. just, I, I agree. Yeah. yeah. No, you, you shout all you want. I, uh, I'm fairly low energy, so it's nice to have someone to, the contrast. <laughs> elite. I mean, you got accuracy now. I think that you could probably take an elite. You got three potions. Let's do too. it. I do like Juicy Bracelet. Juicy Bracelet's an interesting one. Juicy Bracelet. A lot of some players hate it. Some players love it. Some players want to see combats, and then right. some players are like me. You know, I just I, I want more information, right? And the yeah. information that I know, if I go into that question mark room, it will not be a mandatory combat. Is very good. Producing RNG. Yeah, those are always nice. Yeah, I like Juicy Bracelet. I also like it because I just find that events give you things that ah oh, nice that um, combats otherwise wouldn't be able to give you. Mm -hmm gonna not use that I'm gonna, yeah i don't think you need to just in case i need poison stab later yeah and i think you could probably use your ancient potion um if he oh, never mind he's not doing the, the debuff turn first mm -hmm. so that's nice so when is it a good time to block with with this guy <laughs> uh usually when right. you can kill on the next turn right 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 yeah okay usually so. when you're when you're like confident that you're gonna be able to kill without that scaling right. mattering and, I mean, you're getting lucky here with him not using the vulnerable, which is unlucky mm -hmm. in a sense because he's doing bigger attacks, but it means that your blocks are worth more. I've got a 50-50 of drawing my blade dance. Yeah, I would say that you're probably going to kill next turn. Okay. I'll go ahead and block one. Yeah, you got to deal 19 damage next turn. That ain't that bad. Ah, uh, yeah, I can do it. Easy. Together, we can do it. Ooh, that's oh, a good that's combo. A, that is a nutso combo, yeah. I do like the terror as well. Yeah, and you're against uh, Hexaghost. Works well. Wait, we are against Hexagos, right? We are, yes. I'm so smart, I remembered. Uh, yeah, let's... I'm half and half between the terror and accuracy. So, uh, if you upgrade Blade Dance, it's actually more damage than upgrading accuracy, if it's your only oh. shiv card. But then it makes it so that if you get more shiv cards, you then are, like, constantly wanting to upgrade the shiv cards instead of the accuracy. I right. personally... Always like upgrading accuracy, but I get I get yelled at every single time I do it, and my YouTube comments are always like, "Actually, Mister Streamer, did you?" Know well, then I think that's a it's, good incentive as any. Two more damage to upgrade your like fuck, this. fuck you, man. I don't care. Let's let's go for the burning. Hell yeah, we love this. Big dick plays. Let's just do this. It's safer. Yeah, yeah. Stay safe. You gotta be safe. Sometimes it is nice that there's just like no brainer plays like mm -hmm. that one. Uh, but... Easy peasy. You see those occasionally when you start to get good at the game like me. <laughs> yeah, look at you go. Mm. Duplication potion is definitely better than one of those. I like colorless. Yeah. Get... yeah, I... yeah. Hmm. May I offer you the worst shiv card in the game? <laughs> <laughs> Hello. Is it Storm of Steel? I mean, yeah, it's just generally not that good because, like, mm -hmm. it, you know, most shiv cards are like play one card and then you get more shivs, but like, right. they you know, multiply the cards. Shivs, yeah, this and one, also you don't get to play your cards. Yeah, this one's like, hey, the more cards that you play, the shittier it is. Yeah. I, I do like a backstab, it can make things nicer. I mean, I like Storm I of Steel because it's fucking content, but, you know. <laughs> <laughs> Content. I must learn from Let's the best. Let's go. Okay. Um, it's gonna be great in this fight because you're just gonna draw a bunch of, app, uh, uh, of of shitty dazes with it. Right, right, right. I'm gonna. You know what the you know what the giga brain play here is? Let me hear it. <laughs> you're gonna love this. Duplication potion on Storm of Steel to flood your discard pile with shivs <laughs> instead of so dazes. So you don't get the dazes. It is a moronic what? level play, <laughs> but what if we did it? I would probably I, at least serve, like like play like a divine there a survivor first, but um, I'm gonna play defend because that gives us more more Storm shivs. Of Steel. Let's go. Yeah, more shivs. There we go. <laughs> Screw you, dazed. So you probably should have played Blade Dance because now you look at your energy. 
Ah, shit. Yeah. Could have had more shivs. Damn. <laughs> what kind of burning elite is this? Is this max HP? Um, I don't know, actually. I think it's one yeah. extra damage. Oh, is it? No. I, no? No. Because they would have plus one strength. Oh, right. No, I think it's... Uh, yeah, I think it's max HP, and that is like one of the most toughest Act One elites is Tri Centuries with max HP. Max mm. HP is 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 across the board probably one of the toughest. Look at the shifts, baby! Let's fucking go! This is good. Hey, right, so I die in two turns. Yeah, but you got shifts. That is true. Probably one defend at least. Oh, I didn't need to play that. <laughs> Subscribing. Let's do this. All right. Yeah, oh, Hexagos, well. Hexagos doesn't mind. Like, uh, Hexagos is okay. Is the the boss that? Sorry, I'm not speaking words. Um, Hexagos doesn't mind you being at low HP. Hexagos yeah. is, is really really good. For Let's go. This is why we upgraded the accuracy. You fucking idiots in the YouTube comments. <laughs> um, I mean, you guys have you valid wonderful opinions. people who support yeah. us. Uh, Look at you go. You guys are so yeah. smart. Do the math. Hold on. Wait. Hold on. Oh. Math. Storm. So, Mathing. okay. One thing I would actually recommend, go into your setting. Go into your settings and then turn on uh, show card select quick keys. Because oh. that gives you the number of cards in your hand. Oh. I, I prefer this and it's just going to help me here. So, if you play accuracy, don't do it. But if you play accuracy, you'll go down to six cards. And you storm of steel, that's five cards. Each of those ships are dealing ten damage. You'll kill that guy. You'll kill the guy on the right, only taking one damage mm. from the louse. I do like that. Uh, let's We're do it. We're scheming. See, this is a level of play that I don't even like. I'm not even in the same galaxy as. We're scheming. Do you know how Hexagos's card pattern or attack pattern works? Uh, depending on your max HP. Yes, actually, uh, it will always do like a, like a debuff in the first turn. Um, then six attacks the second turn, depending on your max HP. Turn HP. And then. Huh? What's it's up? Your current HP. Cur sorry, That's current HP. Yes. HP. Yeah, yeah. Current current HP, and then it does a bunch of attacks that give you burns, and then it buffs itself, and then it does like more, a few more burn attacks, and then like a big burn attack. You know, if you had asked me which attack gives me burns, I wouldn't have known. So, um, mm -hmm. yeah, I was just going with the the second turn attack and why it's okay to be low HP is is right, right, right. As of the uh, yeah. Um, Acro here is interesting. I mean, it allows you to get more cards in your hand for better Storm of Steels. It allows you to discard some cards. This is your second discard card, too. So, mm -hmm. yeah, it allows for more synergies in the future. I think it's, I think it's pretty good. Yeah. Now we consider Good whether or not we want to rest or go into this fight with six fucking HP. <laughs> I, I'm going to go the safe route because even if we survive, like, all the burn attacks and stuff like that, it's the big burn attack. And if we have the, the burn pluses in our Wait hand, a second, I'm going to die. Are we going to mm -hmm. kill them? People before they get there, because that's the goal. <laughs> yeah. Hexagos is a damage rush, and they mm -hmm. want you, People if you can kill them, most chance. of the time, that's your goal, is to kill them before that, the Hexa Slam is what it's called. Uh -huh. Hexa Slam. I do, have a, I do have a skill potion as well. Yeah, and that can save your ass at some point, right? And so if you rest right now, right? Right now, Hexagos is going to do one times six on turn two, right? Uh -huh. And if you rest right now, it said 20 HP. You're going to go, you're going to go up two brackets, right? Because it's based on multiples of 12. So, so when you're below six. 12, yeah, it's going to do three times six on turn two. So that, at minimum, is going to put you back down. You're going to be at 26 HP, eight minus 18. That's going to put you two HP more if you have drawn no defensive cards. But you also have to take into account, what the fuck are we upgrading? Pretty much nothing. So, you know, it's, it's, uh, you could upgrade one of your blade dances. You could upgrade terror to make it easier. You could upgrade prepared because it's uh, good against the burns, right? Well, we, can't make, content we, 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 can't, we can't make content if we're dead. As much as I like making content. Yeah, yeah. Okay. Um, I'd probably play acrobatics, well, try to find your accuracy as soon as possible. Yeah. Try to get there. Okay. Even back the for it. F it. Yeah. All hey, right. But you can, you can, you can, you can do your thing. Oh, hey, look, Storm of Steel. <laughs> Absolutely. Thirty-two damage in turn one. Good. Not bad. Not bad. Hey. Sweet. Sucker, sucker punch. punch. Fantastic. Uh, sucker punch. Defend. Sorry, accuracy. I would honestly probably look at your skill potion now. Because if you get a card that is like Piercing Whale or something... Malaise. Malaise does indeed exist. Okay. So are you, are you cool with taking six damage? I think six damage is probably fine, right? Yeah. 
Uh, so what you and can it do also is you can, reduces future damage as well. Yeah, you can accuracy terror and then malaise for one, and it'll put him to a one times six. Because you'll get mm -hmm. one one strength gone and then one weaken, which put him to one times six, and then you're set up for your future turns. I like that. I like that plan. Notably, if you had upgraded, they'd be dealing zero right back. now. Wait, so I saying. Something Peepo picks up penis okay by chat. Peepo leaves again. Why storm oh, of steel here? Pick up your penis. I could. I would probably prepare to see if you can find a defend. Or a sucker punch. That works too. Yeah, that works too. Look at that damage, baby. Let's go. Hexa slam mod check. Hmm. Yeah, here I'd care about your HP a little bit. I'd probably double defend. These, these attacks are not your your big damage attacks, right? So, yeah, yeah, wouldn't yeah. Be, it wouldn't be mincing words over. Good, that was really good there. That was really good there. Mm. Um, notably, you uh, you had said always draw first. If you had drawn yeah. there, you would have drawn into acrobatics, and then if you would have right. been like, oh, I should draw again, and then you would have shuffled the, the blade dance back into the into mm -hmm. it, it poorly. You wouldn't have, but now it's in your draw pile, so you're guaranteed to draw it and then kill him. Yes, good. We're doing yep, good. That was place. on purpose. I definitely thought of that when I when right, I played that. Where do you go, champ? <laughs> Ooh. Boom. All right. Boom. Now storm is still for content. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> I think he's dead. Yeah, he's dead. Woo! Excuse Easy. Sam? Look at that. Mm. They get a permanent blaze. I, I like all of these. Or an alchemize. You got five potion slots. Chat Ooh. input. No, don't just type sex a slam. That's not. <laughs> Nightmare is not but content. It is notably a dead card. Think about how many accuracies we could have, though. Think about how many accuracies you're not going to get to play. Ah. Uh, All of them. Okay. Blaze is really, really good, but, like, Alchemize with five potion slots is insane. Because you can prepare so well for boss fights with that. But also, are we not just wanting to farm question marks next? That's <laughs> true. Like, are we not just wanting to farm question marks with Tiny Chest Juzu? I'm going to go with Alchemize. I think, yeah. it's, I think it's more fun. Ooh, I like a Calling Bell. You do. Do you know how to get rid of the curse, like through glitching? Uh, not through glitching. I know that um the Omomori can get rid of it. Yeah, there's uh, a so speedrunners use a glitch that gets rid of all the cards, notably in Pandora's box. Uh, that yeah, but it can you can do the same with the curse. All right, your content all right. killed. No, that's right. insane. No, you just got that's insane. No, you just got pogged up. You got all <laughs> powers upgraded, but notably, tough bandages. Mm -hmm. Remember that footwork that we didn't take? is because tough bandages exist. Bandages mm -hmm. is insane. You know what you get from uh, Curse Spell exactly? What do you get? You get one common relic, one uncommon, and one rare. Ah, So I if see. you're looking for a specific relic, maybe consider that you only have a one, people like only one of those has a chance of getting thing, them. Peepo piles like, gotcha. in like, you your three pants and also Peepo pees passionately in your So rooms. we've got quite a few question marks this way. We could... Go this way, get a relic, an elite, and a bunch of upgrades. I'm so sorry. I was being spammed with the garbage TTS about Peepo picking up your penis. Um, could you repeat what you were just saying? Um, See, this is why I wanted to collab with you. Yeah, is this why? I don't I don't get that exciting stuff. I'm like boring, like chill, like uh -huh. oh, this uh, comfy stream, which there's nothing wrong with, but like I don't get the exciting stuff. I, I need the highs with the lows, you know? This is a high? I like this route uh, with the shop so I can get a bunch of question marks and potentially a relic with the, the Elite and a bunch of upgrades. Yeah, and then let's scroll back up a little bit. I mean, if you're feeling ballsy, we can go for multiple Elites too. Like if if we, if we get to like, there's multiple pivot points across that path that would allow you to take multi-Elite paths. And so like, mm -hmm. if like we get to the point, you're like, dude, this deck is fucking, notably if we get a calculated gamble, that's when we know. Mm -hmm. Sweet. I should have. Mm. Should have, could have, would have. Oh, well. Look at that, Dan. Look at the block, though, from the, the Storm of Steel. Your Storm yeah. of Steel went from being one of the worst cards in the game to being one of the best cards in the game. Come. Stop saying come. Sorry. <laughs> Just like yelling at children. Come, you know? Cume Gang. Yeah. Can I kill you this turn? Probably not. Uh, it's 15 times Maybe 3. 45. I mean, it's still the best play. Yeah. Oh man, and here I thought I was going to be the one embarrassed in front of the cool streamer. Are you getting cum donations too? Uh, no, but I, I'm i always nervous around other content creators because I'm like, oh, I just want them to think I'm cool. 
And I don't, I don't want to say something stupid, you know? But it's good that your chat's breaking down the barrier for me. <laughs> Way to Come. go, chat. I don't know, actually. I, I would take Crippling Cloud, out. but I don't know. Like, I feel like that's no, just... No, I just want you, to... You already have two applications a week in. Don't clog yeah. your deck. You took a, you took a non-energy relic. I would not be taking super high high okay. energy stuff right now. Yeah, just skip. Probably none of these, yeah. yeah. I just had my wisdom teeth removed. Uh, Joe yeah, Cat is shot. very cool, and thank <clears> you for being here, Frost. Could remove. Yeah, I think removal here is fantastic. Strikes are absolutely a plague on your deck now. Yep. So yeah. We got shivs. Yeah, you got shivs. Um, I mean, on sale prepared is interesting, because again, remember every single time you discard, you're getting blocked. Yes. So, it, so it, it, it's... Uh, Maybe take it. There's also better cards, but I mean, like, it's oh, wait. Yeah, yeah. Not a bad I always idea. find myself regretting spending money whenever I run into another shop. Stab him! So sorry, I fun full screen you when I did that. <laughs> oh my God, Frost! What ah! have you done? Ah! Over my dead body. We kill mm -hmm. bear in this household. We do. Yeah, I'd probably play Alchemized. You could also play your Ancient Potion this turn. It's not a bad combo, but you just got Ancient Potion and uh, Speed Potion combo, which is notably extremely good against the heart. But, mm -hmm. you know. This I guess is my maybe only Terror Defense so or just Double Defense. Too much of the I would stream. Terror Blade Dance. I, I would take some damage here. So cool that if okay. you got a Deathline Duel Master card, he wouldn't punch you in the face for it. Mm. Hi, Frost. Yeah, don't forget. Mm. Remember that, that we didn't take the footwork, but we have the Storm of Steel. We that do. Blocks, <gasps> that blocks does not get reduced with the with the damage down. So I would right now I would play Blade Dance and then Storm of Steel. Is a billion block in the same amount of shit. <laughs> yeah. Fuck you, Bear. Eat shit and die. So between these two, which would you say is uh, the more prioritized? Um, uh, the uh, the guy in the back, he always. Uh, with Romeo, he always debuffs you and mm. weakens you, but I usually go for pointy just because he has lower HP. Yeah. yeah, me too. Wow, perfect block. Look at that. Amazing. Look, accuracy finally decided to show up. Mm -hmm. Hunt. Let's see what else we got. I could do the risky play. I would acrobatics here because if you draw Storm of Steel, it's insane. And you, again, yeah, you okay. get block off of it. Yeah, and then I would weaken Romeo. And then Survivor again. Remember, has that tough bandages block on it too. Yeah. yeah. Not taking that much. Oh, sweet. <laughs> you gotta be careful God, how many times you're doing that Storm of Steel combo, man. You are flooding your discard pile. <laughs> okay. Oh, no. I never considered that. I almost never take Storm of Steel, but like, oh, yeah. I never considered, you know, like, yeah, tough bandages is a relic that exists. It's a rare relic, so the likelihood that you get it is few and far between, but. When it happens. Okay, taking more damage than I would want to take, but nah. such as such. Who's count? The game is. Uh, yeah, you're dead. You have Regal Pillow, though, so one campfire. I we're, do. We're back in good shape. But Let's go! Sorry. Yeah? It's weird that the game's only giving you one card to choose from in this card award, isn't it? <laughs> you didn't take Busted Crown, so awkward. Oh, hello. I am streaming. I'm streaming with that guy that I watch all the time. Stop saying it's going very good. It's true, Frost. I watch you all the time. Echo can... Uh, right? Yes, yes. I can confirm. Yes. Okay. That's that's Echo, my partner. What do they think of my content, though? What do you think of Frost Prime's content? Based on how much you like it, I guess it's good. Yeah, there we go. Your happiness is their happiness. I, I'm willing to back up Joe in anything he says. <laughs> Probably just go this way. Oh, yeah. We hate our cards. Goodbye, Strike. Uh, I still I, no. I do not think go we're doing. Way. Yeah, I do not think we're doing that. Yeah. Elite man, that is. <clears throat> yeah, Regal Pill is gonna get you nice and healthy if you want. But here's the thing, I'm greedy. Mm -hmm. Right. No, I understand. <laughs> no, I probably should. Yeah. There are times that you you know don't want to rest there. If like the next floor was a uh, a chest, I would say oh, don't boy. rest. You can, yeah, go for it. Oh boy. Use bigger uh, blade eight. Dance first. Yeah, let's use one. Oh, do you have? Do you have lethal on both of them here? Because if not, you want to use storm of steel, right? Yeah. 
Oh shit, I wasn't counting my energy. Fuck. Uh, oh, okay, okay. well, I'm gonna take 8 damage. Hey, this is not that big of a deal. In before I Should lose I give, because uh, of 8 Chat damage. wants me to give you a compliment now? Um, <gasps> so, notably when I first started seeing your content, I hated it. <laughs> oh, I mean, it's not for everyone. <laughs> Oh, I understand. Um, Some people just don't no, like strawberry ice cream. No, <laughs> no let me explain. Sorry. Um, mm. So, you know, I do the meme reviews, right? And right, right, right. People very much liked your crap guide to D&D series in my, in my audience. Uh -huh. Very much liked it. But I have never played D&D before. Mm. And so I knew nothing about it. And when you haven't played D&D, it just looks like a complicated mess, right? And yeah. so... They kept sending me these videos, and I was like, guys, stop sending oh, me these. I don't know I'm what so the hell sorry. is going on. And they kept doing it, and I don't know if it was a meme First or not. I stabbed and then yesterday. I played, like, th two rounds of D&D &D within two weeks for the first time. I played two rounds of D&D, &D and I binged the entire playlist. Aww. It's the best content. Yeah. No, that's totally valid. I'm so sorry. I, no, I get annoyed at my... No, no, no. But it's just like, I don't know. It's it's a weird thing because it's like, guys, if they don't want to watch it, stop sending it to them. Like, they'll they'll watch it if they want. If they're not interested, stop it. No, stop but they, it in they, 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 they drilled it into my head that it was something I needed to watch. It was because they knew oh. I was going to start playing D&D &D within a couple of months. We had been talking about it for a while. And so... When I was lurking yeah. in your chat earlier, uh, I heard you talking about it. And mm -hmm. it's it's a fun hobby. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Maybe backflip, maybe skip. Yeah, I mean both are both are valid. Expertise is also a fun way to get off more discard synergy. It is an expertise like getting plus, off. notably. Uh, yeah. Okay. Yeah. I mean, I think uh, expertise here is pretty valid, especially here's here's the reason why it's valid. You have prepared mm -hmm. in your deck. That's draw negative. Same with survivor. Right. It empties your hand so that you can draw more cards. Okay. I think it's good. It's a free upgrade. Yeah. Take free upgrades. We take those. Um. Yeah. Content. Oh. <laughs> So here's a problem I have. My, right. whenever I run into these things and then I have like an explosive potion, I almost use it, like almost immediately. That's fine. Explosive potion is yeah. like the, one of the worst potions in the game. Okay. Like it's it's like, it's like when the hell else are you gonna use it? You're either gonna use it right to to, de to deal in an AOE fight, or you're just gonna like hold it forever and it's gonna suck. That's true. Do I take no damage here? Yep. No. If I acrobatics. You acrobatics, but then you're drawn to like possibly accuracy, and then you don't get it yeah. off. Yeah. I would take one. Right, my chat is spamming that they want crap guide to STS, so so no, sorry. No, I'm I've already said this before, but after I finish the uh crap guide to Final Fantasy, it's done. The series is over. Really? Yeah, I'm just I don't know, I'm i I'm tired of the format, you know. Yeah, no, I I, I wanna try other things. Yeah. 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20. Yeah. Definitely go for one of them, yeah. And, and then neutralize just... that guy so he's weak in next turn because it's a fifty percent chance. Look at that. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I would say that I am okay at this game. It's like some some small stuff I get, but mm -hmm. uh, I, mm. I wouldn't. I wouldn't. Because yeah. if you look at the map, if you look at the map, uh, if you take a lot of damage in this fight, you just go right and you still get that campfire into that question mark mm. that guarantees you a relic. That's true. So like, it, there, again, this is a pivot. So if if, if this if you draw right. right now with backflip and you draw into Storm of Steel, you're literally take zero damage. So like. Look at that! This, Let's go. There we go. Uh, what's four times eight? Uh, thirty-two. <laughs> uh, thirty-two. Is that enough? That's enough. Yeah, that's yeah. uh twenty-nine. Thank you for subscribing. Unless I want to put it all on the gremlin leader. Uh, yeah. I mean, I probably honestly would have gotten accuracy off and not played the blade dance. You would have taken a little mm. bit of damage this turn, but would have set you up better. Yeah, I think I think have. if if yeah, I think you definitely probably need to kill Mad Gremlin here. Yeah, because I would take damage anyway. Mm -hmm. I like big ships, even tiny ships, really shiny okay. ships. Right. Okay. In your tiny ships, at I like the blade it, no. dances to stab the bad guys. So they're Chat, not behaving. The storm of steel. They have made a size. And I like, I like girls draw. copy pasta, like oh, but no. I've replaced no. girls damage. with ships. Play ships for free. <laughs> I'll have to look at that. Uh, yeah. It's very creative of you, chat. Way to go. Um, proud of you, guys. So proud of you. Right, that's another you one that I'm, here. like, in two minds about because uh, it it has become cringe fuel to a certain subsect of people on the internet. No, I love it. Yeah. 
I mean, I'm, I'm still proud of it, of course. It's, it's a fantastic like meme. Big shivs. Thank you. Even tiny shivs. Stuff really later. shiny shivs. Hell yeah, that was the smart play. Shifts, There's a good chance like to just draw these blade blade dances To stab the bad guys. Five. Yeah, there I we like go. like a storm of steel. With every hand size. Perfect lethal. I like the card draw. I like accuracy. Cat, I don't like it when it says the in your hiney shivs. I don't like that. for free. Oh, all right. Look at that. Hell yeah. Um, I'm okay with taking none of these, yeah? Um, yeah, so the only one that I would consider is that all out attack plus. Oh, yeah, that's um, true. Discard. The only thing that's bad about it is it discards randomly, but as long as you play it at the end of your turn, it's a little bit extra block. And remember how we talked about, like, you're trying to prepare for later fights? Reptomancer exists, right. and she really sucks. Reptomancer does. Yes, yes, yes. <laughs> she sucks I a lot. So, honestly, really have I would AOE. Yeah, I would throw yeah. one in there. All right, that's yeah. good. And look, now you're, oh. you're healthy. Remember, you didn't... Oh, never mind. I am. <laughs> you could have taken that I elite, am. I think. Well, I was thinking, like, going this way for two elites, potentially. Oh, but then, oh, uh, there's yeah. a relic this way. That's true. So, well, it no, would have I mean, been... Yeah, I mean, you could even... if You, you can go that way, and there's a question mark up there if you don't want to... Ah. You don't want to fight another lead. The the notable True. thing about elite fights is it's not just a relic. So that rare percentage thing that I told you about, mm -hmm. it's increased by some arbitrary amount that I can't remember off the top of my head because fuck remembering all that shit uh, in, in elite fights. So you have a greater chance of seeing rare cards from elite fights. So mm -hmm. taking elite fights is still good even with tiny chest. Let's see. There's a lot of options here. Billion of them. Oh, I'm overwhelmed. Uh... <laughs> It happens. Yeah, I'd probably drop. Probably, yeah. Oh, fuck yeah. I I would probably recommend with all of the um, with all of the wounds getting put in your deck to probably not flood your deck as well with shivs this time. <laughs> right. Um, yeah, because they're not. Do we want to try and draw for? Well, no, I wouldn't be able to play it. I was gonna say draw for accuracy, but I wouldn't be able to play it anyway. Um, I mean, you could uh, neutralize, and then once you mm -hmm. neutralize. You'll be at what nine cards, and then you play one shiv, and then you could acrobatics into it, and mm. you just wouldn't play storm of steel this turn. So you wouldn't get like a fucked on a block, but you could still get accuracy off, and you wouldn't be taking too much damage, right? Because we don't have like anything that's like crazy good to upgrade now. Yeah, now if you play acrobatics, you draw three. Hmm. <laughs> okay. Yeah, I think uh, alchemize here is fantastic, dude. Yeah, you think so? Yeah, yeah, I think that the damage oh, hey. thinking is... Mm, that's not going to be enough. Unfortunately, no. You are, you do have all of your shift cards in your hand, I think, right? Or do we have one more blade Yeah, dance? which is bad. Ah, we got one more blade dance. Okay. That's when we can probably use it. You're not getting weak mm -hmm. into this turn by the blue slaver, so... Just got my wisdom teeth out. Some frost is content is the right play is to kill the, the red slaver ordered. first? Yeah, yeah, the vulnerable sucks. I, I think so. Yeah. Um, I think you could even consider using that uh, the, the accuracy and the potion here. And just okay. deal like omega damage. All right. And then you get AoE. Maybe. Uh, do you want to block? That's a good question. I do want to block, okay. actually. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. That's fine. There you go. Yeah, just do using that. Uh, like in that fight, I would always want to make sure to use that potion before uh, Blue Slaver debuffs you because it sucks once they do. Let's do that. What about be limping out of this fight, baby? Hmm, 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 hmm. Acrobatics, notably, is two less block for one extra draw. It is. It's just, you know, oh, hey. That's whatever nice. you think is more valuable. Uh, yeah, I think it's important to kill. Wait, what? Uh, oh! No! Thank you for subscribing. Ouchie. Wait, I'm still subbed. I don't complain, just forgot. Mm. Have fun, mm -hmm. you to you, woo. So just a little tip there. Huh? Tiny tip there. Uh, look at the card reward before you bought uh, something next time. Yes. Because like, if you got like adrenaline or something, just like something that's really nice to have in your opening hand. Then you yeah. can bottle that. Mm -hmm. I see. Yes, good, good, good. Bottling Minor Alchemize is not a optimistic. terrible play. There's a lot of decent options here. I, uh, taking draw always in your opening hand is, is decent. So like acrobatics or backflip, prepared. Just having like more yeah. options in just <laughs> Hey, it's a lot of good block on turn one. <laughs> a lot of good block, and if we draw an accuracy turn one and then Storm of Steel, it's just like you nuke somebody. And That's dead. true. Hey. Content. <laughs> Another acrobatics? Yeah, I think acrobatics here are fantastic. We're definitely going to look... You can take the smoke bomb. Yeah. There's a smoke bomb glitch, too, which is pretty fun. Oh, what's it do? It uh, 
Look at that. Look at that. Look at it. Look at it. You can even tear. Oh. Sorry, Chad. That was our, That was me. Um, I stubbed my toe there for a second. Um, oh, it's okay. So the smoke bomb glitch is smoke bomb when you use it takes like 1.5 seconds to like fully activate, right? Um, and if you kill the enemy within that 1.5 seconds, so like, you know, if you end your turn as the defect and lightning kills or like poison kills or something like that, um, the timer remains if you are in the card reward or looking at the map. And so then you can go into the next fight and they will instantly win. So you can use smoke oh. bomb on the act four elites and then smoke bomb the heart fight. Wow. <laughs> oh, hey. That is another way to do a lot of blocking, but I just don't know if it's necessary. Mm -hmm. I think it just might not yeah. be necessary. Otherwise, the rest of these are just kind of... I'd probably get rid of a smoke bomb for the attack oh, potion. Yeah, thousand percent. No, I think that our deck's really strong. I don't think that it needs a whole lot of upgrades right now. That's why mm. we were able to take that more dangerous route because we're okay yeah. with just slamming upgrades. Yes, yes, we are. We blocked that... these. Probably wouldn't play that. But now not this. Playing the... Yeah, not playing the all-out attack first because it could get mm. rid of your good cards. And. Day, 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 day. Thank you for subscribing. I think I lay into this guy. Yeah. Eight months spare. Yeah. Maybe Love Storm the Steel content. Get some block going. Keep it up. Swag yeah, I mean, down, you could probably. I would down. not shuffle your shivs into your discard pile. Because mm -hmm. all you need right sure. now is two discards in order to full block. So, yeah. Easy peasy. See, see, kids, video games can teach you math. There is a setting in the, the SDS settings that does, like, damage calculations for you. Wow. It's just too many numbers on screen for me. It overwhelms me. Yeah. I think she's dead. Yeah. See, every time I'm like, oh, boy, poison at the front. And then, like, no, just <laughs> shiv deck. Yeah, none of these, yeah. I don't know. Okay. Think you can take another leap? I could. When was the last time we saw a rare card? Um recently right we we had a the the one the unload. dagger that discards all your yeah unload yeah so your rare percentage is pretty low okay let's take this mm -mm. sundial i'm like whatever on sundial i feel like it takes too long to happen really i love sundial yeah i think it's fantastic mm -hmm. notably only because a card that we are going to scoundrel for is uh calculated gamble which is just also like, i actually, forget we're playing the silent and silent shuffles their deck very often. Yeah, the silent does like to draw. Mm -hmm -hmm. Yeah, so you I would it? take it. Yeah, I would take it. All right, let's take it. Cat, we're not getting an infinite. This is not. This is. <laughs> this is not a shiv infinite deck. That's not going to work. I actually don't know how, what to upgrade here. I'm like, um, terror alchemize. Prepared is also neutralize. a really good option. Get to see more cards Prepared. and get more block. That's true. I do like more block. I mean, zero mana, draw two, six block. That's insane. It's better than backflip. All right, what potion are we using? Probably dexterity, yeah. Sure. This. I don't want to storm of steel my shivs, do I? No, not not when you need to like do specific things here. See, storm mm -hmm. of steel is one of those cards that I would rate very low. I do not think it's that good of a card. Sometimes. <laughs> Sometimes it's really good. Look at it go. So how much is we can 25%? So I can't full... Oh, I can full block this. All right. Yeah. Dex potion. Let's go. You and Joe Cat mesh really well together. Oh, thanks. Excuse me. Both of us are in relationships. <laughs> oh. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> oh, good. Um... Probably get rid of the terror, yeah. You could also prioritize playing it and taking a little bit of damage for it. It's All up right. to you. What's in your uh, your draw pile right now? Press A. Oh, yeah, you can do it. Damn. Sometimes it doesn't let you. Yeah, you're probably not going to be able to find block, are you? Maybe with draw potion, you could. You could hmm. find, like, a, a storm of steel or something. So I think it, I think it could be worth to... I would have wanted the expertise first, but... All right. That is a heck of a lot of block there. And probably, I would probably drop the expertise. 
Is it now? I, yeah, yeah, you're drawing three. There's a chance. There's a chance you draw something sick here. There's a chance you draw jack shit. Look at that. <laughs> mm -hmm. uh, I'll do this since it'll give me slightly like, more blocks. Well, Blade see, Dance I have... allows you to kill someone. It does. And that is 11 blocks. I'll, do that. I'll kill this one since the other one's lower. Okay. Hurts a little bit. A wee bit. Uh, sorry. That was just... That was in-game noise. Weird to happen. <laughs> just do whatever's natural, man. Yeah. Um... Yeah, let's do this, because I'm not going to be able to kill you. Yeah. No, getting, I will be able to kill you. Getting right, that three. guy killed, too, before you get debuffed is super important. Oh, sweet draw. Oh, sweet shibs. Oh, yeah. I probably wouldn't draw more. Yeah. Okay. Because right now, Storm of Steel is once again your best block card. No. <laughs> Ironic. Uh, yeah, there we go. The shibs are protecting us for... Holy shit! That's a lot of damage. It is. It's in the draw pile. Hmm. Matisse is interesting. Um... Oh, this is a tough one. This is uh, a lot of damage incoming, Joe Cat. We are not <laughs> in a good spot. Um, no, we're not. I can do... If we so survive this be... turn, next turn we're not weakened at all. So right. literally just need to get through here. I'm going to try for a skill potion. Actually. Yeah, I think that's smart. And buh. That's a lot of block. Um, that should help out quite a bit. Maybe smiley face. Do we want to use the second potion and get rid of that speed potion? I know we wanted to save it for the hard fight, but you can't get to the hard fight if you're dead. And I like I'm, I'm like wanting to do math, but also like my brain is failing me today. I'm gonna use I'm gonna use it. I'm Hell yeah, ahead. safety. Mm -hmm. Yeah. And then you could go for the uh, zero cost weakening here, reduce that damage by a heck of a lot. Yeah. And then probably just gamba. Here we go. Sundial. This is hey, why we Sundial. Take the sundial hey. <laughs> Hell yeah. Right. That works out. Pro I'm just going to try and lay it. Yeah, him, we can kill him. I want to kill him soon. No, that's, that's, that's a death. That's a death? Oh, no, look at that. Sundial. All right, I take back what I said. That's fucking Another well, alchemy. <laughs> you could. I mean, we're we're breezing through potions right or now. Or we could take nightmare and have four alchemizes. Or four storm of steel. Yeah. We just don't have the energy to play it really, which is the annoying part. No. Yeah. Yeah. Without like. I do. It, it's. It, I know it's not guaranteed, but I like to take it just in case I've run into something later. You know. <laughs> yeah. I mean, it's it. The thing is, is you already have one curse in your deck. <laughs> So, getting another one does suck, but you do also yeah. have a lot of draw, and I think we are going to prioritize getting some sort of energy relic here. Hopefully, it's not forcing us into a coffee dripper situation. Okay. Alchemize, then? I mean, you, it, it's up to you. I think Nightmare you can make work. It's just going to probably be less useful than Alchemize more often, but then it's like when it is useful, it's like super pogged up, but it's like, yeah. It also has upgrade debt, like it needs to be upgraded. In order to be it more does. useful, it does. Does. Yeah. I'm gonna do it. Okay. I'm gonna take the risk. Hey, look at that! No energy. Eat shit. Yeah. <laughs> Immediately <laughs> punished. Uh, astrolabe. Astrolabe is a fantastic relic. It is just insane. Curses good. only transform into other curses. Yeah. Curses. Yeah, they do only transform okay. into other curses. Yeah. Okay. Um. Yeah. All right. So two strikes and a defend then. Yeah. Thousand percent. All right, well, let's Is that butt cheeks? Eh, no, one of them blocks. Dagger throw's not bad. Outmaneuver probably can actually be quite useful for us because you can mm -hmm. outmaneuver and then, like, Storm of Steel or something, so you get a bunch of block and then survive that turn. And then next okay. turn, have a bunch of energy to be able to oh, play hey. stuff. I mean, like, it's not looking good. I'll be honest. It ain't not looking good. Not a bad boss good. to go up against, though, considering our setup. We have no powers. Yep. Well, actually, we have one power. So. But, yeah, that's basically no powers. We are forced into it. No, we took the green. Uh, took the burning elite. Hell yeah! So here, I would probably want to count question marks, and see if there's a free relic that can happen. Three, four. 
a decent path. One, two, three, four. Yeah, we've got we've got this path on the right, and then we've got this one like middle left. I like. Well, we don't really need that many upgrades anymore. We well, that's not true. We got terror nightmare. Maybe I mean, one terror of the doesn't dances. need to be, but it's helpful. Makes me feel more. It's more freeing. It's yeah. like airing out the the pits, you know. Yeah. Whenever you I, go I, for a long run. Yeah, I definitely think that pitting. you want to go to one of those two early shops. I think that that definitely should be a priority, no matter which way we go. Mm. So, I am. Um, hmm. I mean, do you? Fe I, I feel elite. like since we took that all-out attack too, we do have really, really good chance at dealing with elites. I feel yeah. All right, let's go the elite pass. Did we get enough question marks? I don't remember. Uh, well, we need... Uh, yes, there's one. Either way we go. Two, three. Oh, shit, no, it's not. Ah! No! All right, well. Actually, I think I could play the outmaneuver. Yeah, no, this is one of those times where outmaneuver is going to be amazing. Uh, do you know how the slimes work in terms of attack? Yes, the outer slimes will do double attacks. Did you watch my video and on it? More, is that why? more damage. Maybe. Okay. <laughs> I just like your content, man. Listen, dude. Let's get him low. Yeah. Lesser player would have killed the left one, but you didn't need to because you were blocking it. So, yeah. Hell yeah. Not. We'd love to see it. Mm, you probably get see. a kill on both of those guys. Yeah, perhaps. No, you don't. Damn. Close. So close. Damn. You probably could have killed the middle guy, actually, and then not taken any damage. Yeah. Six damage ain't that, ain't that bad. See, that's what a Remember to good use your player would do. Yeah. Ooh, that's good. All right. Oh, my God. We're getting so many good cards. Another acrobatics? I think a third one is perfectly fine, yeah. Can allow us to get Sundial off more often. Just block. Yeah. I think that's probably the maximum amount we want. The next things we want is like upgraded preparedness and again that calculated right. gamble. Reflex is a is definitely an interesting one too. Um, mm -hmm. Yeah. Bird face turn is cool. I like that, but we don't have any powers. Clockwork souvenir is interesting. I could take clockwork souvenir mm -hmm. and a panic button. That's not bad. Panic button is like a card that I feel like a lot of people scare away from, but it's actually like an insane yeah. card. Even if you don't, because again, you have the alternative block, right? Mm -hmm. So. Panic button does not stop you from being able to get your tough bandages off. So, do we want to remove anything? Yeah, I think you can, can remove defend. poison stab. Yeah, poison stab kind of sucks. Okay, I think I'm good. Strips artifact, but like, yeah, yeah, no, you can definitely save. You got the Act Four shop because we're gonna get there, right? Mm -hmm. We're gonna get the Act Four, a hundred percent. Definitely, definitely getting there. Uh, oh, that's a full hand. Look at that. Wow. Return. Good time. I would say sometimes in this fight, you can prioritize killing the... Uh, I don't know what the hell it's called. The guy on the left. Because putting dazes in your drop oh, kind of sucks. Yes. The repulsor. Um, Pulsar. Like if you feel like you're dealing enough damage on average every turn in order to be able to kill both guys. Because like you have until turn three to kill the, the, the exploder, right? That's true. You got a minute. It would have been sick okay. if we had gotten wrist blade in this deck, man. <laughs> mm -hmm. It would have been sick. Um, Good turn for expertise. Shitty turn for expertise. I was wrong. <laughs> uh, I can't hear this. All right, I'm liking this more. This is where that prepared plus comes in, baby. Mm -hmm. So much block. I was just going to do Absolutely. this and try and kill him. Absolutely. Hey, you got so much energy. Oh, hey. Oh, oh, don't don't Never mind, don't use Aqua. Oh, was bad. Was, no, it was, it was a bad no, play, It didn't happen. It would have been, uh, been a smoke bomb. It's fine. <laughs> yeah. It's a smoke bomb. Yeah. Sorry for yelling about the prepared buses. No, it's okay. I would have been in the same situation. Hmm. Yeah, so notably here, you could probably uh, 
use your shivs and then expertise into a bigger storm of steel, but does Ooh. that is that necessary for all the block? Yeah, I think so. Uh, yeah, I was gonna say I would like to. Yeah. Concentrate though, chat. I mean, he, he we're not we're drawing a lot of cards, but like usually we don't really need to play them all, you know? Like usually we're able to like refine down what we're playing by quite a bit. It's not always necessary. Probably no. I was gonna say panic button here just so I can play accuracy and like set up. I mean, yeah, it's literally but... free. Like, it's not gonna hurt you to play panic button. Yeah. So. Oh yeah, we have the synergy. Yeah. Sweet. So sometimes it works. Kill you. Yeah. Sometimes it works every time. Uh, can't kill you. This is an annoying yet. spot to be in. Draw me shivs. Draw me shivs. Uh, not quite shivs, but close. It's annoying. I mean, I would definitely uh, remember that you can be a lot more lucrative with your potions. Um, oh, we have so many of them. Hold yeah. on. Yeah, <laughs> like you can be a lot more lucrative with your potions, especially since you have, uh, yeah, you, since you have the thing. So, yeah, and now you full block. Wow. Since you have alchemize, you can be very. You can be. I mean, you even have an entropic brew. You can use your oh, What potions, if I need like, them later? Crazy. <laughs> if I use the potion now, then I won't have potion anymore. What if I need them next run? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> hmm. Probably none. Nothing. You'd so Dex many acrobatics baby. plus, man. Yeah. Damn. Skip. Yeah, I think so. I don't think you need uh, another acrobatics. You can, though. It's not terrible. Mm. This is uh, always a, a fun choice to see whether or not <laughs> your deck is going to go infinite at this point, because Madness just allows you to go infinite. But I don't think you ever are. <laughs> no. But notably, if you have a lot of cards in your hand, you can Madness, and then that thing will cost zero. And then if you Nightmare it, those things will cost zero. I'm pretty sure. I think that's how it works. I don't know. I wouldn't take it here. Max HP, then. Yeah. Hurts. Hertzy squirts. What? I'll take the elite. Hershey squirts, you know. You know. Oh, do it. Do elaborate, please. I need you no, to say I, it. No, I, I refuse. To, yeah, they give you just anyway, maneuver. Uh, then, yeah, you can just own them. Always remember in this fight to just uh, to play your play your skills first. Yeah. yeah. So yeah, I think out maneuver uh, and then storm of steel is gonna full block you later. So. Maneuver. Ah, that's right. Yeah. I don't want to use my shifts, do I? You do. You definitely do. do. Okay. Definitely do not want those guys coming back. Yeesh! 120 damage. No, Chad, that's not a new chocolate brand. Actually, yes, it is. Please <laughs> Google Hershey Squirts. Hershey Squirts. To figure out this new chocolate brand. It's a special promotion they're doing over Halloween. Oh, my gosh. Oh, my gosh. You know what? You could have nightmare to shift there. <laughs> that was so next stupid. Turn. Three mana blade dance that procs next turn. Bounce. I think he's actually dead this turn. Yep. Yeah, look Magic at that. of shivs, baby. Hey, nice. That's fantastic. Uh, another blade dance? <sighs> See, like, you're getting into the realm now where that accuracy can get so deep in your deck that, like, it's, uh, it's tough. It's true. There is some merit to a finisher as well, but if you had, like, pen nib, it would be really good. Yeah, the problem with finisher, I find every time I'm like, oh man, I get a good enough turn for finisher, but then they're already dead. Mm -hmm. So I never even get a chance to play finisher. Yeah, in the what first do you have? Place. Three blade dances in your deck or four? Uh, one, three. two, three. Yeah. yeah, three. Three and a storm of steel. I think you're fine. <laughs> I think you're fine until you get another accuracy or like a shuriken or mm -hmm. something else. Actually, I think I want to recall here. Good. <laughs> we like early recalls. Is that yes. early? Yeah, just because it's like just in case you want to rest up next to the boss. Mm -hmm. Just in case. Just in case uh, uh, Nemesis wants to do the big attack next turn and you get fucked. Except you won't because you can just use your liquid memories on Storm of Steel. Oof. Get down. Shouldn't be too bad since you got Terror off. Yeah. 
Is the game lagging? I'm watching through Discord chat, so it's not gonna oh, be. Oh, sorry about that. It's not gonna be. It's, it's Discord's not the purest of ways to watch things. Uh, there you go. You see, look, no hands, chat. I'm playing Slay the Spire with my dick. <laughs> <laughs> wow, amazing. He's so talented. Actually, I could have sh shiv there, get the one one damage off, but it's fine. Sundial! Woo! Yeah, baby! Use these. Oh my gosh. Would you like Yo, draw, I like, by the way? I hear you like acrobatics, so we had your acrobatics draw you some acrobatics. Actually, I probably want to do damage. When time. I first played D&D, our, we named our like group of dudes called the Acrobastards. Mm. And essentially... <laughs> so every single time that we would either win a fight, meet new people, or notably wanted to jump a gap. We would always roll <laughs> to see if we could do a backflip while doing it. That's amazing. <laughs> yeah, I heard you talking about D&D &D and like some of the stuff it's like uh, people were mentioning, um, like, oh, this is broken, and blah, blah, blah. But, like, the DM has a lot of control over the game. Yeah. So, they, just... whether it's broken or not, they can just have the people react. Oh, that's pretty good. That's really good. That's a good upgrade, too. Mm -hmm. So, yeah, the, the DM can literally just, like, say, fuck you. Yeah. <laughs> like, they, like you what can, you need... Yeah, it'll be like, oh, this thing that you want to do is OP? Okay, you've entered into a room where that no longer <laughs> is capable of happening. The oh, boom, sweet. we called it! <laughs> Nice. Yeah. Perfect. Yeah, like the the DM can literally be like, "Oh, you when you fart, you fart fire." Yeah, this is a <laughs> um, non-flammable room. Nothing yeah. you do will. No farts are allowed. Yeah, or the DM will play along. It really depends. Like it's like mm -hmm. you got to find a DM that plays along with you, really, and is willing to, um, you know, yes and you. It's all improv, you know. Because I uh, I had one game where I was running for some players. They were in, like, a, an abandoned factory. And those of you in my chat, you'll recognize this is Necrohunt, uh, what's it called? Dungeon. Uh, and there were a bunch of mechs, like mech suits, like from Alien. Um, but one of the players pulled, like, the pilot out of the mech suit and <laughs> wanted to pilot it. And I was like, I really don't want you to pilot this mech suit. <laughs> But that was really cool, so I'll let you have it. Oh, and uh, for the rest of the campaign, they were just walking around in this fucking, like, loader. Could have just been like, uh, okay, you come across the control panel. There's a bunch of buttons. Which one do you press? Oh, sorry. That was the ejecto button. <laughs> yeah. No, I'm not, I'm not a mean and also that Those are the things that, like, they'll remember forever. <laughs> Scar them for life. It was a little scary there, but all is fine and well. I feel like killing uh, killing that guy should give you a relic. Just as, as props. Yeah, even if it's literally just like a, like a, the opposite of spirit poop, you know? Where it just <laughs> gives you plus one to your score. Way yeah, to go, champ. It. I would take a piercing whale here, but the deck's getting pretty big. Eh, thickness is not bad. Yeah, okay. Like, 30 is usually my max. I don't like to go. Nah. I've had a 69 card deck. That was a good nice. thumbnail. Mm, I'm feeling confident. Let's do it. You're easy. Feels weird to have a full hand every time. <laughs> uh, let's do this. And Ninja Scroll is a relic that sometimes you, you have to skip. Yeah. It's annoying. I feel it. Annoyingly so. But if you get, like, uh, if you're playing this island, then you get Bag of Prep. Oh, you're already weakened. Okay. Oops. Well, could have Storm of Steel. Oh, well. You see, Storm of Steel is not a card that I use ever. So it's weird and different. Ah. You could play the okay. Piercing Whale here so it doesn't have to get back in your draw pile because you're probably just going to, like, bum rush this that guy. That right? is an idea. Actually, expertise first. And then... Well, I'm only going to have one. Yeah, I wouldn't probably draw here, probably. Accuracy. You can look yeah. at your draw pile and see what it is. Like, if bad cards oh, yeah, you just it's... don't want, then you can yeah. draw into it. Hmm. 
Yeah, I wanna... It's not a lot of... Yeah, it's a lot of defensive cards, which I will need later. So, let's get rid of them for now. Yeah, I think accuracy is definitely your best bet to play. Okie dokie. Might as well get rid of those two. You should be alright. We got mm -hmm. Sundial this turn. Yeah, we'll kill him this turn. Watch. 100% every time. Yeah, oh, we'll yeah. kill him this it's, turn. It's <laughs> oh, man. Here we go. Alright. This and this and this. Oh, I should have done that first. Oh, well. And this. Oh, no, you're dead. Oh, hey, there we go. Whoo! Baby. Getting a little spicy uh, here. Don't like any of this. Yeah. Okay. Yeah, I'm feeling feeling good. Would you like a rare relic or dying immediately? Hmm? <laughs> Come on, accuracy being the top 20 cards. Fuck. I think it's fine to just Storm of Steel here. I mean, like, or you could draw into Storm of Steel. Yeah, I mean, yeah. you don't want to draw into the accuracy now and then not be able to play it. But always, always lucky, never punished. There we go. Pendant, baby. I love Pendant with Shift decks because you don't have to think about it. Very prepared. Yeah, prepared before right. XP. Yeah, there we go. Yeah. Sweet. Hey, there it is. Boom. And uh, this full block. Hooray! These guys gave me the most trouble when I was just first started playing. Oh, they're bastards, man. They scale so fast. This this fight actually used to be a normal fight. This used to a not be inside fight. the event. Yeah, the event used to be oh, different. Shit. I don't remember what it was. Wow. Chat backseat. What was it? <laughs> Chat backseat. <laughs> Oh, this used to be an elite. That's what it was. That's what it was. Oh, yeah, just it used to be normal elite. elite. Okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Didn't guarantee you the rare card. That's what it was. You guys are smarter than me. Hey, Ooh, let's that, kill our that deck. Is a, that is a question. <laughs> yeah, I was gonna say. Please don't. I was gonna. I was starting to yell. Like, please don't take that. We gotta <laughs> before think about I knew. That one. Before I knew about the save and quit exploit, like whenever I would accidentally pick that up, and I would just be like, no. Um. I mean, sometimes it's good, but yeah, I think right now your deck yeah. is like very much a closed loop of liking what it's doing. Mm -hmm. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But it could give uh, you more accuracy. Could. <laughs> um, none of these, right? Uh, yeah. I mean, yeah, the cloak and dagger is not that good. Going into what you're about to do, right? Like the heart fight, you got to remember, the cloak and dagger is not going to do jack fucking shit against. Right, right. Ah. Hmm. hmm. Oops. You can get them really low if you use Blade Dance and then mirror the Blade Dance, but then you don't get the Alchemize off, and that sucks. Mm -hmm. That always sucks, but it's like, you know, your best play is at least to use Blade Dance. I'll get them low. Why not? Sure. Might as well. Less turns I got to fight this guy, the better. Absolutely. Yeah, there was also the possibility that this happened, but that's why we recalled early, remember? Exactly. Yeah. We recall early, so that way we can't recall later. We're not required to. It's okay. Normally, Nemesis is, is very uh, known for giving you the boot, but we already saw it. <laughs> Silly Nemesis. Have we played Nightmare once? No. Oh, hey! Hell yeah! Now we have a nightmare target. Do you know not to drink your fruit juices immediately? Oh, why? Uh, so every event in the game that does anything based on max HP is all, or everything or damages you is all based on max HP. So right now it was oh. fine because you don't have any events left. But if you were going to like go uh, into the, the wheel event and get stabbed, you're going to get stabbed for more damage. Gotcha. Yeah. Let's see if we can get... No, that's going to... Overdraw. 
right. This deck really likes drawing all of its shiv cards early. It's a <laughs> notable flaw. I would actually consider using Ancient Potion here. Ancient Potion? Yeah. yeah. Get rid of that construct. Oh, I already have, I already have an artifact. Yeah, but he's going to... So um, uh, he is going to debuff you, and then he's going to attack, and then he's going to try to debuff you again. I think. Uh, or is that not what he does on Ascension Zero? Uh, or Ascension Lowest Engine? No, no I think he has done that. I think he has. I might, I might have fucked you. No, no, no. It's fine. I consented. Oh! Blushes. <laughs> Derogatorily. <laughs> All adults here. <laughs> yeah, whatever. I'll just get rid of this. But yeah, I think, yeah, he's going to do it again. Yeah. See, you were right. Gotta believe in yourself, Frost. No. I could have done this. I had my pen nib ready. Yeah, but that would have probably killed them in time for you to not have to utilize that second ancient potion. So, really, <laughs> like, you were just wanting to make me feel good. Yeah, of course. About my misplays. It was really good that you drew that prepared. Never punished. Frost is my favorite streamer, derogatory. What the hell does that mean? <laughs> what does that mean? You can't just put the derogatory emotion after everything, even though I just did that. Uh, none of these? Yeah. You know, we are currently in a situation where you have not seen a calculated gamble yet. So blocking is a, is a fucking bitch for us, right? Mm. And blocking and dealing damage at the same time. That's true. So I think that cow traps could be good for the heart fight. I think I think it's it's okay to take. You just don't play it in this next fight. It's just like nightmare. It's a curse. I'm gonna rest. Absolutely. Yeah, I was gonna. Was gonna. Okay, here we go. Because you have another power now. I think after image might be worth playing, even though Birdman will get mad at me. So does he gain but, one strength or two strength on Ascension, on Lowest Ascension? I don't remember. Let's see. Uh, bosses are deadlier. I assume two with that. Yeah, Oster. that might mean he gains two strength. Uh, but if he gains two strength, right, the multi-attack, is it still one, chat? That's saying it's still one. His power okay. shows it? Oh, his power shows it if you hover over him. Oh. Um, Increases attack by yeah, two. Yeah, gains one strength. Okay. Oh, wait, no. You're right. Yeah, curiosity. Whenever you play a power, it gains one strength. Sorry, I was looking at the actual strength buff. All good. Um, yeah, Probably so that means it. that... If you play a power, it needs to be, like, especially a defensive power. At right? the offensive power, that's a different. That's how you're dealing damage. At the defensive power, you need to make sure that it is going to scale regularly with that. So, like, a big uh, thing is, like, people with a defect are like, when should I play my powers against this guy? And it's like, yes. if you play a loop, right? If you play a loop plus, and you loop plus a frost orb that has no, uh, no uh, focus on it, right? That's going to give you four extra block a turn. And on Ascension 20, he's dealing eight extra damage on his uh, mm. on his multi-attack turns. So it's not worth it. So it's not worth it unless you have other things to combo with it, right? Gotcha. And so here with, with After Image, you're playing shifts. You're easily yes, going to get are. four block a turn off of that After Image on average. So yeah, mm -hmm. I think it's fantastic. All right. And I'll stay the accuracy for now. No, I think oh. the accuracy is fantastic. Or oh, you think so? if you really wanted to say it, you could play Cultist Potion. But again, I, I think, yeah, I think the accuracy... It is fine. Person. Mm. You Person. wouldn't save Cultist Potion for, like, the heart. Well, you, actually, that's... No, because we don't want to stay in the heart for too long. I mean, you could do both. I mean, you can you can do whichever. Like, it's... I, I think that accuracy mm. here is fine. Most likely. Mainly because we're also not really upset if we have to rest at the beginning of the next floor. Right? right. So just fighting okay. this one guy. It's all good. Mm -hmm. Ross telling someone else to drink a potion? What is this? <laughs> Listen, the chat telling you potion all the time, they know that they also would miss the potion. Yeah, Let's be honest. This guy literally signed up to get back seated. What are you guys getting yeah, upset exactly. about? <laughs> literally messaged me and said, could you back seat me? Should I tear this guy now or no? Yeah, yeah, that's fine. Yeah, okay. Let's yeah, no, because the, the first half of him is really, honestly, the scarier half. Um, mm. And then once you get past it, it's just about surviving enough in order to you know not get boned in the second half because like if you're not strong enough to perfect the first half you're probably not strong enough to perfect the second half so, yeah i would not play cow traps that is the one i would probably say fuck it to Incoming. i can alchemize. alchemize hell yeah that's a good potion yeah 
block potion. We love to weaken, baby. Oh my gosh. I don't think I've ever drawn so many cards in my life. Oh my god. I remember at the beginning of our conversation when you said, I don't think that uh, uh, shivs is a good way to win. Oh, I didn't say that. I was just like, I worry because I always love playing shivs, yeah. but I worry if it's not good enough at higher ascension. Right. Um, although maybe I did say it like that. I don't know. I have a bad memory. Maybe I'm lying. Look at your maybe I'm gaslighting you. Look at your draw pile. What are the odds that we draw back to piercing? Well, that's my question. Well, we do have Panic Button, so I don't think we're ever going to take damage next turn. I would honestly probably play Block Potion if you wanted to use one. And then yeah, not use well. Piercing Well. Because you know about resetting his strength? Uh, Yes, actually. Yeah. Uh, from your video. <laughs> Look at this smart guy. Watching the I best am. content. Mm -hmm. Yeah, so I could, like... You not... know, dude? Here's a, here's yeah. a five head play. Mm -hmm. We get to use Nightmare. <laughs> <laughs> you can nightmare your blade dance. Yeah, there we go. And then just panic button. Is this turn? Yeah, yeah. All right. Because we're, if we're, if we're going to try to get off that uh, that piercing whale, right? Or you could kill him this turn and you have a billion you have a billion blade dances next turn to get a bunch of block with. I mean, all of this is good. Oh, I could have. Oh, yeah. Yeah, mm, you would have been able to reset I was not anticipating. Him. Yeah. It's fine. We'll just kill him. Yeah, I mean, Survivor's going to be probably enough block for you to not take a whole lot of damage. Yeah. Blade Dance is blocking for as much as a defend. Yes, that's true. Well, actually, one less. But... No, it's five cards. Oh, no, and you're right. Yeah. It is one less. Yeah. You're right. But I think I think 40 damage probably justifies it. Mm. God, aren't those prepared pluses just so... Yeah, hot? I wouldn't have... See, this is why this is why I wanted you to backseat me because like all this stuff like I wouldn't do normally on my own. You might be able to find your uh, storm of steel this turn. Get three more energy. He's down there. Hmm. You're guaranteed to draw it now with the acrobatics. Yeah. Plus. All right. Sweet. Get this. And then even if I don't kill this turn, I will not take damage this turn. My God, I love shift decks. Who's got the shift copy pasta? <laughs> what is the shiv copy pasta? The one that they just made about I like oh, girls. Oh, like the, the I like shivs. girls, yeah. <laughs> oh gosh. More shivs. My goodness. If we get a calculated gamble at all in the next act. Set. I'm gonna lose it. I like big shivs, even tiny shivs, really shiny shivs in your high. Careful about using that like acrobatics here, because you might draw into a void. The bad guys. I like um, a storm ah, yeah. It's probably okay, because you have the ghost of protection I like the card draw. I like accuracy, 50 damage, play shivs for free. Yeah, it's probably Yeah, I don't fine. know what to do here, actually. No, it's, it's fine. Because you, you're, if you draw into it, you're gonna it's going to take you down one energy. You're not going to die from this. This isn't going to kill you. Yeah, oh, look, but the health. Point. There's a one in three chance that you get the tactician off the dagger spray or dagger throw, but probably not the best. Nah, I wouldn't use a potion. Oh, well, it's too late. I did. Shut up. <laughs> a good potion uh, usage. Really uh, like the hustle. Yeah. <laughs> it's yeah, plus just, your, your best. Yeah. No, it's, it's backflip plus again. We're doing the same thing. Look at me go. Just I'm just scaled. I'm, I'm a scaled whittle new player. Not new player, but like casual player. I'm not I mean, thinking, like, 5D chess like you are. Yeah, I mean, you're not taking a whole lot of damage off of this. I think playing Blade Dance Plus is fine. Oh, Everybody, we have right. Sundial, baby! Oh, yeah, that's right. See? Calculated. You're just smarter than I am. I am. Your I am has you're passed. playing 5D chess. I'm playing chess 2. <laughs> Never heard that one. Yeah, t chess 2. There we go. We're all good. Never punished. Streamer privilege. Etc. Etc. All right, so I've never reached the heart at this high of an ascension before. Really? Yeah. Like I think the highest I've reached it is three, and the highest I beat it is two. Okay, what do we do here? 
honestly, tactician. Tactician? Chess yeah. 22? It's going to feel yeah. so good. Okay. Drawing into that with acrobatics. Ooh. I could mirror the... So here's the thing. I think this might be a noob <laughs> trap, is I like to mirror after image. Right. Yeah, because um, that almost blocks. guarantees. Yeah. But I don't know. I'll take your advice. Chat saying mirror Storm of Steel. Could I don't also, know, maybe. No, I don't think you need to mirror the accuracy chat, because we took the count drop specifically for the hard fight. Oh, that's a hard choice. Like, Adrenaline's fantastic. Ice Cream, fantastic. Dolly's mirror, I had to say, is probably best on your tactician. Tactician, okay. Yeah, that's going to allow you to go, like, virtually infinite with this deck. All right. Virtually. All right, I'll take your word for it. Yeah, if you Dolly's mirror that tactician plus, that's going to go cool. very hard. Um, and you can even we... take the ice cream too, but then you just have to play like super big brain. Mm -hmm. So if you want to go like Omega brain mode, we can do that. Let's do it. Well, lit plants plus. Yeah. Yeah. Cause you know yeah. what that does? It make it, it, it helps out your storm of steel. Yeah. Yeah. This is an insanely good draw. I am once again Do you have damage to kill the guy? Sorry, sorry, I interrupted you. No, no, no. I, I'm just saying I am once again choice paralyzed. Uh, do we have enough damage to kill the guy? So, ships are going to deal 10, and you'll have a billion 90 of them. damage. No, I'll have 80 damage. What about because, uh, if I? No, oh, no, no I'll have it. 70. Because I play Accuracy and then Storm of Steel, and I'll have 7. Have the rest Unless... of my picks. No, yeah, I think you were thinking that as well. Yeah, I was thinking of the terror. Yeah, so I think accuracy, and then if you storm of steel with the shivs in your hand, mm -hmm. um, you're gonna gain the most amount of block, and then get be able to get one of them fairly low. I can't remember if this is the turn. Did he did the the shield blocks just himself? No, he's gonna do the negative effect. He's not blocking at all. Yeah, yeah, he's I'm just debuffing you. Strength. Um, yeah. So, weirdly enough, just like off of my own knowledge of the game, facing the shield actually is a total of a little bit less damage. Pretty sure on this turn. Okay, so yeah, because... Um, let me look. So, yeah, 14, 18. That's 32. And then the other way was... 21, 12... 32. No, it's the same. You kill this turn, by the way. You have pen to... Oh, sit. I think, right? Uh, yep. Last one. Oh, no! It's okay. We're two damage off. We're, we're facing the right way. If we don't draw any damage card next turn, I'll give you 100 subs. <laughs> <laughs> they look damage Gulp. cards. <laughs> and you do the fucking piercing well. This is, can't get any better than this. And you do the panic button. Can't get any, any better than this. Easy peasy, baby. Did you just discard your damage card? What are you doing? Hey, are you trying I to get, another one. You trying to get 300 subs off me, dog? <laughs> it'll work. I'll do it. Uh, hey, alchemize. Yeah. Oh, yeah. There we go. See, we're fine. We're <laughs> fine. All is well. And look, our, our captain's wheel went off. Expertise time. And tactician. And might as well. Wow. I took like, what is it, two damage this whole fight? It's pretty good. It's pretty good. I think Joe Cat win the Spire if it had sword and shield. One in the chat if you agree. Okay. All right. Um, Bottle of Flame kind of sucks. Yeah. Using Bell's great, though. Yeah. Yeah, I mean, piercing well against the heart is just returns. We, there's nothing we want to bottle, is there? Um, you can bottle a card that you don't want in your draw pile, like Skewer. Hmm. <laughs> you can draw it so you're guaranteed to draw turn one, but then it makes it so it's less likely you draw, like, Welly Plains and Caltrops early, right? So, like, yeah. it sucks. It's taking up a draw slot. Yeah, yeah I don't want to take it. It sucks, but it's good, but it sucks, but it's... Yeah. Okay, Ka -ka! I've been watching both of you for a long time. So excited and to see it. I would definitely use Ancient Potion here. 
Because yeah. you can block okay. the vulnerable for next turn. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Then go nuts. Oh. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, shivs are free uh, early on in the fight, right? Because of your yes. thing. So yeah, just tear and pop off. I probably wouldn't play your your acrobatics because I wouldn't want to draw into your something that you really want to play. Yes. We don't get weakened. Mm. Let's go, Caltrops. Perfect timing. And you have the Sucker Punch here, so this is really only one times 15. I do. So yeah, I wouldn't even play Panic Button. All right. You could use a potion if you really wanted to block four, five, six damage, but I wouldn't. Ah, that's nothing. I'll save it. Look at that. Heart's hurting itself. Okay. That was a really good turn order, too, because now you get Captain's Wheel. Oh. Juicy, juicy. Now's a good time to use those block potions, too. Yeah, actually. Perfect. I think yeah. outmaneuver is probably more valuable than playing the... Yeah, uh, I was thinking the same. Yeah. Three damage. Hmm, hmm, hmm. Hmm, 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 hmm. Ooh, maybe that was bad. What? I didn't see it. I don't know. Just, like, drawing all my stuff right now. <laughs> What's in your draw power? Right, so, um... Not good for next turn. That's for sure. Uh... No. Right now, heart is buffing. No, you're doing good, because... No, yeah. you got good stuff next turn. Okay. All right. You'll be all right. Yeah, that's fine. Oh, wait! I have a skewer! Hell yeah! Energy I efficiency. can use all that energy. Or do I save it? No. What can I What can um, I play? I'm going to draw five next turn. Yeah, yeah I'm mean, not going to be able to use that energy no, anyway, you right? No, could, you could save it for Nightmare. You could, you could save it to, to have a good Nightmare. Oh, okay. Yeah, that's actually a really good idea. All right, I'll do that. Do you know if you played Piercing Well this turn that you would actually give the heart six strength? I did that accidentally once. I was like, <laughs> I'm going to try that that thing that I learned from Frost on the heart, and then it gained more damage. I was yeah. like, oh, fuck. Yeah. So here's okay. a really good time to probably... You could Nightmare Alchemize and get a billion potions. <laughs> it's actually a really good play. Um, All right, let's do it. And then I would, know, I would play Alchemize, and now we need to figure out a solution because we're dead on screen. So, let's figure some shit out. Oh, shit. Yeah, we'll just start. We have we're, yeah, so we're gonna use that last. Bamming those potions. See what we can get. Dash is fantastic. Dash. And block potion is fine because remember we have after image, so like we're not ever losing yes. block by playing cards. Yeah, and then we drop. Do we use the brew now? Thousand percent. All right. <laughs> 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 This is fantastic. This is amazing. Use them all. Let's strength. Yeah, yeah. strength potion it up. Right. Kaka X2. Draw me my cards because now you get right. neutralized. And so now if we find one way, one more way to debuff, we can use piercing whales. So if you entropic mm -hmm. brew again, because we got the infinitely scaling entropic brew, now you can duplication potion your uh, piercing whale. Ah, sick. Look at that. Hell yeah. Dude, we went from wow, dying to zero damage. <laughs> the plays. I would like to point out that that was all skill and not luck. Mm hmm. My god. Hmm. Probably just blessing this here. Oh, yeah. Okay. Fantastic. Look at all that energy gone. Get that out of here. Hmm, 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 hmm. Look, you drew another entropic group. Wow! Wait, I said that as you did that. I, I was just making <laughs> yeah, a meme that you had alchemized. You can read the future. Oh my god. What the hell? Let's use this. And, uh, Very important. Let's see what our power potion. can be. Oh boy, ships! Hell yeah. Um, that energy is free, remember, because you have ice cream. So you can just go true. ahead and Entropic Brew again. Oh my goodness. <laughs> I'm an alchemist. <laughs> Yeah, let's just use it all. Let's get a just go. skill potion for another alchemist to get another entropic brew. <laughs> Damn it! There we go. Really unlucky, Reflex works though. To be honest. Practically infinite. Practically infinite. Oh, 
We're gonna do it! Wow! Yay! Uh, I didn't say a uh, witty one-liner. Shit. Ah, come on, man. Ah, uh, that's why I can't beat High Ascension. It's gotta, like, I gotta come up with my one-liners. My gosh, I did it! This is the highest ascension I've ever beat the heart! Thank you, Frost! Yeah! It was all you. Oh, you did it all by you yourself. Helped. That was great. I'm glad I got to do it with a ship deck, too. Heck yeah. All right, now I want to see how you play. Hi. I mean, I, I see how you play all the time, but I want to I, I want to show off to my chat your I'm going to play on Ascension 20 and lose. All right. 